Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Rachna and here on my channel I talk everything about beauty and makeup but today we're going to do something different and we're going to do the ethnicity tag. There's six questions which I'm going to answer for you guys. So if you'd like to see the tag then please keep on watching. Please don't forget to click on that like button. Do leave me a lovely comment below and do subscribe to my channel. If you'd like to see my ethnicity tag then please keep on watching. The first question is where are you from? I am from India. And I was actually born in India too. The second question is, what part of the country are you from? I am from the west side of India, which is Gujarat. And to be specific, um, I'm from a place called Baroda or Varodra, however you want to pronounce it. I was actually born in India and I was one and a half when I came to the UK. The third question, when was the last time you visited your country? The last time I visited my country was in 2012, June 2012, which was five years ago now. I had gone on for holiday for two months and I haven't been since then. I am planning to go in February 2018 because my cousin sister is getting married. So I want to go to her wedding. Yeah, I haven't been in a very long time due to university and studying and stuff, but I do want to go back. I just want to experience everything again because I love going back to India and as a child I would go back every two years ish and in the summer holidays our parents would take us and we used to have such a good time there connecting with my mom's side of the family my dad's sisters and their kids and all, all the cousins and yeah it was just great and I have so many amazing childhood memories of going in the summer holidays so I definitely want to go back and I can't wait to go. The fourth question is, name one ethnic food that you enjoy. There is a, just one. I enjoy so many different types of Indian food. I like Indian street food is my favourite. I think that pops the charts for me. I love Pani Puri, Pao Bhaji. I love um, Vora Pao. I love... Uh, what else do you get? I like bel, seo puri, dai puri, dai wala. I love all of them. I like all those street foods. I feel like that junk, street, oily, spicy food is my favourite. I also like like chilli paneer. I really enjoy dal bhat. Dal bhat is like my favourite. I enjoy a lot of Indian food. I can eat it regularly, every day. I can eat Indian food all the time. It's so yummy. I love my mom's homemade food. I don't really have a sweet tooth, so I don't enjoy the like sweets or we call mitai. That's not I'm not a big fan of sweets except for kaju katri. I can have pani puri all day, every day. I always get told you shouldn't go to India on the first day and eat pani puri. But what do I do? Go eat pani puri. Like I love it. I can live off that. I love it so so much. Street, Indian street food is the best. I feel like and um, all that junk is what I like to eat. <laughs> Yeah, I do enjoy curry and chapati and dal and bath and everything like that, but street food just tops it for me. Question number five, name one household item that best represents your culture. I would say the household item that best represents my culture is um, a villain. If you guys know, you know, <laughs> uh, a villain, which is um, a rolling pin that we use to roll chapatis, rotlis, as we like to say in Gujarati. Yeah, I feel like every single Indian household or Gujarati household, however you want to say, has villains. I personally don't enjoy making rotlis at all. I just feel like it's such a long process. But in Gujarati households, yeah, we do have rotlis every single day. So it's something which is used regularly. So villain is definitely the household uh, item which best represents my culture. I think for sure. A little secret. I can make rotis, round, fluffy, they puff and everything, but I hate it. Like it takes you forever to make the chapatis and it takes like two seconds for someone to eat one. I, I, don't, I don't enjoy making rotis at all. It's just something I don't like, but I do enjoy eating them. My mom makes the best rotis ever. On to the last question. The question number six is, do you speak your language? I do speak Gujarati very fluently. I've been speaking Gujarati since I was born because I was born in India and also when I came here it was a language which was mostly used in my house and that's the only way I could communicate with my grandparents. I speak it fluently, I understand it, I just can't read it. That's something I didn't learn. That is all the questions in the ethnicity tag. If you enjoyed the video 
click on that like button and I'm going to tag all of you watching this video to do the ethnicity tag. You can do it in the comments below or you can make a video and then send me the link and I will watch it for sure. Um, that would be fun. I would love to do that. Thank you so much for joining me. Please don't forget to click on that subscribe button and I'll see you in my next video. Bye guys.